everybody, welcome to another video of LSPDFR. My name is Toxin Master. Today I'm going to be doing, um, I'm going to be driving the, or we're playing LSPDFR, but we're driving the uh, Crown Vic uh, with the Los Santos County Sheriff's uh, Apartment uh, skin with the, um, with no brush guard, just a regular light bar with the, uh, the county outfit that goes with it. So, uh, yeah, we're going to, this is pretty sweet. Uh, now, the reason why I'm using the Los Santos County skin like this is because my county where I live is exactly is exactly like this one. So, yeah, this is exactly like my uh, where I live. So I'm gonna still do my intro while I'm talking or while I'm in route to this call. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed today's video and uh, let's see what goes on today's patrol. Uh, first, we're gonna be taking this arson call. Uh, yeah. I hope you had a great day. Um, my day's going pretty well. I mean, I can't really tell you on the day that this happens because I'm pre-recording this. So, anyways, we're going to be in route, uh, code 2, because I don't want to freak the uh, guy that's trying to catch someone on fire or blow something up. Uh, so we're almost in, on in or in route or on route, whatever you want to say. Uh, we're gonna be it's gonna be down here at the Trevor's Meth Lab. I don't know if Pacific name you like to call it, but you know I just remember from the story mode. So um, we're gonna be RE 1097. Go ahead, turn the siren off. Holy crap! Dang. When you hear, I thought he was carrying a, uh, a, a pintrol can. We'll take care of this. Alright, I don't know what they were trying to say, because they was talking to me while I was freaked out. So, we're going to be uh, trying to see where this guy is. He's going to be in this area. Where is he? There, there he is. Yep. That's a petrol a petrol can whatever he said this is a jerry can put get on your knees i just shocked you in the throat i know it hurts but should have been running you shouldn't have blowed anything up get on your knees you know the fire department has to work extra hard because you're hiding in wants to blow up something all right so we got one to fifteen i'm gonna get a prison transport to come pick him up uh we'll just get back in our vehicle and wait on the prison transport um, but we, our car needs to be cleaned. Gosh, look at that mud. Uh, let's see. It's probably get dirty after I pull out of here, but. Alright, I have no clue where the prison transport is. Oh, yeah, I do. I'll leave our lights on. Alright, I'll just hold eight. I'm holding eight. It's freaky screwed up. There it is. So they're uh, 1097 and going to be there for that mail. Way to start an episode off, I gotta say. Way to start an episode. Uh, but let's see what else goes on today's patrol. What in the world? Somebody's shooting over here. Who has a gun over here? Who's shooting this deer? I want to make sure this is a deer. This doesn't look like a deer. It seems like some kind of hunter was trying to shoot this. Yeah, that's a deer. Alright, well, we're going to leave the deer alone. Hopefully, he'll get off the train tracks, because that's not what we want. Uh, I don't know what was going on there. Anyways, we'll take this wanted person call, since we didn't get to take her call that we wanted to take. Uh, but, yeah, I hope that, uh, that, not the horse, but the deer state's fine. So, resisting officers with violence. This suspect is wanted for resisting officers in, with violence. So, we're going to be, uh... RD-1097 and he- OH SHOOT! You wanna use shotguns? I'll use them too. 
You want to freaking shoot me? So uh, I'll shoot you back. Okay. So we'll get a uh, corner now here for this mail. All right. So I'm just gonna pull off the side of the road. I gotta fix my car since it does have broken glass. All right. So let's see. Corners already 1097. So. I'm going to turn my radar off. So, uh, yeah, there's really nothing I, I can do about this call. I ended very quickly. Let them do what their job is, and they're almost done. So, I'm going to be 10 8 and code 4 from that call and see what else goes on. Alright, so we're going to be pulling over this motorcycle for uh, having no helmet. Alright, they're going to be running from us. I'm not going to call any backup for this. Because you can't really, uh... You can't really do much but hit him off the back with the motorcycle. Hopefully he wrecks into somebody. And, uh, if you heard my phone go off in the background, that is that is my ringtone. Alright, so... I'm going to try to get a license plate on him. There we go. Got a license plate. So... Hopefully he'll wreck here soon. I'm gonna call air support. Found any more for register on there. Mike Richardson, he's running from us. Hopefully it's the register on there. Alright, I'm just gonna try to wreck him off of it. There's or maybe get in front of him and stop it. Got no tail out now. That didn't work. I'm gonna try to get in front of him and stop him like that. Alright, stop, dude. Pull over, dude. This is air support. Suspect is heading north. Alright, uh, he's still running. I don't want to shoot him off the bike because that's. I know it would probably kill him. At least we have air support. Gotta clean my vehicle. Sorry about that. Alright. Uh. I'm not gonna call any local units. Sorry about turning my lights off and stuff because I'm trying to get everything fixed. God, I didn't mean to do that. I accidentally clicked the button. Had to turn him off. Um, so he still want to run from us. We're gonna try to. Uh, this is the only thing we don't have a freaking push bar. So I'm gonna try to recommend this guardrail right here. Come on, wreck, please. I'll tase you off of it. I'll tase you off your bike. Don't make me do it. Don't make me kill you, asshole. Get up on your knees. Alright, that's good. Get on your knees. At least we didn't really have to hurt him when we did tase him. That's not really it don't it wouldn't really hurt. It would, but then it wouldn't really damage the suspect that much. So we're gonna get him out of the road. We're gonna get his bike out of the road. Put him in a, I'm gonna put him in our vehicle. Breathalyze him. Search his uh, vehicle. I'm not gonna search his vehicle. Usually, when you search their vehicle, it crashes the uh, vehicle search mod, and that's kind of stupid. But I don't know. Let's just pull him right here to the side and clean our vehicle, fix our vehicle, and get a tow truck out for this vehicle. All right, so. Tow truck's coming out for them. I'm gonna get a prison transport out for him, and we're gonna be doing a multitask here. So we got two things in route. We got the prison transport and the tow truck. So two things at once. That's pretty good. Um, so once we get the prison transport to come pick up uh, him, what she has. So we're gonna be uh, 10 and code four from here. We might take like two more calls because that was a pretty long. Um, Thing, or if we have a maybe a, uh, a traffic thing uh, or in a, a call or something like that and maybe we'll do that somewhere else uh, but you know okay we're gonna be pulling over this sand king for running the stop sign it's gonna be occupant times two alright I can't tell the traffic stop because it wasn't allowing me to pull him over at first uh, we're gonna do our spotlight since it is a bigger truck. 
Let's see. There we go. Let's see. Looks brand new. Nothing wrong with your vehicle. Or no, nothing on the license plate. We're going to run her license plate. Alright, my vehicle is locked. Ah oh, shoot, what is her name? I know I think it's the last part, right? That's it right there. Okay. And, uh, license valid, no warrants. Uh, so I'm gonna give her uh, a hundred dollars hundred dollar citation um, for running the stop sign and almost he was she's good at almost hit me. I just want to give her a citation, you know, for her to not to do that again. This will be our second citation she's had, so we'll be uh, ten and code four from here and see what else goes on today's patrol. We'll probably take one more call and then uh, end the episode. Uh, but yeah, it's been a good one though. Attention all units. Units report. So we're gonna take this homicide call. Uh, it's gonna be right behind us. We're gonna just kind of sneak up. I'm just gonna go code two. I don't wanna. I'm not gonna use my siren. I'm just gonna use my lights. All right. Just gonna try to pull up quietly without them knowing. Alright, go ahead and turn all our stuff on. 18 wheeler, if you keep going, I'm gonna have to kill you. Alright, at least he's running. And he's not, he didn't, the 18 wheeler can go on now. But you're, I'm gonna say you. Again, if you run, okay. So, the taser was deployed, and we're gonna get him on the knee, on his knees and arrest him for uh, homicide. Uh, so, anyways, we got one ten fifteen. I'm gonna get a ten sixteen. Pick up him, and we had a backup unit come. We had a backup unit come help him. They're gonna try to kill him when they can't, cause. He's already in cuffs, so. They'll get him and uh, put him in the, his, their back of the vehicle, so. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure to leave a like on the video. Subscribe for more LSPD Bar videos or any kind of other videos I post on my channel. Uh, I'm trying to hit 150 subscribers. But, uh, yeah, and if you enjoyed today's video, click the like button. It always shows me your support and all that stuff. Let me know in the comment section below if you like these kind of videos. Um, but yeah, that's going to be the end of it, and uh, I'll see you next time.